Some people come in your life as your guardian angel, you know what I'm saying? As your your angel for real. We have angels in real human form. I've been other people's angel. For some of y'all, I am y'all's angel. And 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 that's crazy because as y'all's angel, your angel ain't feeling too good. You know what I'm saying? Your angel is not in the in the best mind place, the best the best mind state. But I'm going to continue to do the best I can to make sure I can help other people because that is what I'm here to do, you know? Even when I have to have somebody else help me. We all need help, you know? Um, but she's, she's my angel. And not in a sexual way, not in a, a, a girlfriend way, not in a relationship way. Like, she's my motherfucking nigga, you know what I'm saying? Like, for real. I guess I really don't know what Christmas is all about. Isn't there anyone who knows what Christmas is all about? I can tell you what Christmas is all about. That's not roasting. Like frost nipping at your nose So I'm offering a simple phrase Although it's been said Many times, many ways Merry Christmas to you At one point I had it all if you can rise, nigga, you can fall Niggas claiming they your dog Bitches trying to cut you off Shit, I lost everything Thought about blowing my brain Nigga, literally like Bang, bang, bang I said fuck it, just thug it out No lame shit for the clout Ho Hold on, bro let, let me switch it up When you see that shit, then you better get it Fuck that hoe if she think you trip Get back to the bag and start to flip You a boss out here, nigga, don't forget it <laughs> Nigga, don't forget it Yeah Nigga, don't forget it Oh, you thought I was finished? Nah, nah, nigga, just listen. I was really in the kitchen. Nah, nigga, I was getting it. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nick G, the host. And today, I'm back with another video. And, uh... I got a smile on my face. I am definitely going to start documenting my life and what is really going the fuck on because I'm not being brutally honest with y'all. You know what I'm saying? I'm not. I'm not being honest at all. You know what I'm saying? Y'all have no idea. Okay? Um. So yesterday, I woke up, you know what I'm saying, and I woke up on the wrong side of the bed, okay? Every <clears throat> every YouTuber I know has made a video like this. Just crying. And I always said, like, I don't want to be that YouTuber. Crying on camera. I don't want to be that YouTuber that shows... My people that I'm not happy. I just wanted to create clearly this facade that I'm just this happy ass person. But a strong person that can get through whatever. But truth is, I'm not happy at all um i was very 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 emotional uh yeah i was emotional for not angry i was just like literally upset um and i didn't understand why you know what i'm saying and the first thing i wanted to do was get some liquor which let me realize you know 
it just felt like an alcoholic move so first of all no offense to anybody that drinks alcohol if you feel like you have to drink alcohol to cope and get through whatever it is you're getting through that's fine I'm not saying anything about you I am speaking about myself so you know you get signs before you do dumb shit right and dumb shit you know would be listed as suicide or um anything to hurt yourself harm yourself cut yourself uh running your car off the highway girl I, I know everybody has had these types of thoughts in their mind and before you do the dumb shit um you get several signs several <clears throat> at least i did now i'm not saying yesterday i woke up to commit suicide that's not what i'm saying um suicide should not be thrown out like that just fluently no ma'am um I was just in a bad head space, you know, and I didn't know what to do. I didn't know how to snap out of it, which was so damn frustrating. <clears throat> I'm just now starting to realize that I don't value myself. <clears throat> I value other people. And I try and build other people up. <clears throat> And give them happiness to make me feel better. Not about myself, but just it gives me joy to help other people. They don't have to ask for it. I just do it. And then after it's done, people still going to be people. So, I've been thinking about the negative more than the positive here lately, and that is really my downfall. You know what I'm saying? And I woke up thinking about the negative for some reason. So, anyway, um, you know, me and Jalen, her name is Jalen. A lot of, like, people think her name is Kentucky. This shit is stupid, but her name is Jalen. Um, yesterday, you know, she came back to the crib because I'm still in Kentucky but she came back to the crib and she is so against alcohol and like alcoholism and 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 just using vices to get through things you know um she's actually in the health field something y'all don't know about her but I'm not about to just give y'all all this tea right now I'm gonna wait till uh we do this video but um you know she came back and she took me on a walk um it's they have several bridges in kentucky and to be honest i don't know what the bridge is called and i'm not about to text her because i am on a two hour uh daily two hour phone ban okay my phone is on airplane mode i don't want to be on the phone for two hours a whole day and to be honest i might expand it to be longer than two hours because it's the best two hours i've had in my life you know what i'm saying like just not being on the phone and not looking at social media and not uh uh feeling pressure you know it's so much going on out here in this world man it's so many pressures and we don't know that subconsciously because you know we just looking at it you think you're just looking at shit you we watching people get killed um you know watching people die uh watching people get hurt um you know looking at people and they glow up not realizing that they actually had to struggle before that glow up you know what i'm saying just glorifying shit that you have no idea of what it's like to have you don't know you have no idea what it's like to be in that person's shoes this person may have a hundred thousand dollars but you don't know what the hell he did to get it and you might not have wanted to do it to get that hundred thousand dollars you know what i'm saying and you over here lusting for something that you don't even need. You wouldn't even be able to handle. You get what I'm saying? And she took me to this bridge, you know, and it's a huge bridge. Like everybody just, it's, I'm going to go to it. Um, but you walk around it and then you walk on the bridge and you are over a huge body of water. Um, I'm going to input these things on my edit as what the bridge is and what the lake is. Um and you know she was talking to me and i'm just like 
you know, she has told me several times, like, you just sound like you defeated. And I know I'm including her in this conversation because I want y'all to understand, like, I've been talking to her, conversing with her, period, since August. And it is December. You know what I'm saying? Every day. I've been talking to her every single day. And although y'all aren't clear on this, is it a relationship? Is it a friendship? Is it a boo ship? Like, at the end of the day, she's literally my fucking friend. You know what I'm saying? Like, and she has been my friend throughout this entire process. You get what I'm saying? And it meant a lot for me, for her to take me to that lake and, and, and walk with me and, you know, just tell me like, bro, you, you good. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's a lot of people out here who are in worse situations and like, you have to stop sounding so defeated. Not only that. Maybe you need to quit alcohol. People still... People still gonna treat you how they want how they want to treat you. Whether you help them or not. Because although they needed the help, it hits you different because you need the help more than them. Maybe you need to, you know, change your mindset and your ways of thinking and things that I preach, you know? So I'm obviously not practicing what I preach. And it is just one thing I can say about her is, you know, she'll bring you to reality. One thing I, I like about Gemini is, first of all, I've never dealt with a Gemini. I've never dealt with uh, you know, situations like this and dealing with new people. I, I've had the same people around me for so long and now none of them people are around me. So now I have this new group of people because for, somehow I, I'm always attracted to people. I can never just be alone or maybe I just don't want to be alone. I, you know, at some point you just got to face reality. So, um, these new people that are in my life are just so goddamn honest, especially her. I mean, brutally honest. She's so honest. It She don't care if she hurt your feelings or not. You know what I'm saying? And that's a person that you can respect. But, um, you know, she just was telling me about myself. You know what I'm saying? And and I mean, to down to the point where look how you look. And I it reminds me of my dad. You know, when he used to tell me about myself when I used to be in a dark place because I find myself, I, I find myself putting myself in a dark place. And she said this yesterday because she say I quote things that she say and uh, pretty much don't give her ass the credit. But she said this shit yesterday that she put herself in a dark place. And um, I'm realizing that, you know, I agree. I I definitely put myself in the dark place by like she said listening to music i listen to music that makes me sad when i'm sad because i want to cry right and i can't cry unless i listen to this this specific music you know and it's like i want to cry i want to get this feeling of just crying you know because i feel like with crying that's a uh that can be a form of therapy depending on who you are right and I am an emotional being, whether I want to admit it or not. So crying sometimes I feel like it's good for me, but I have to listen to music to do it. You know what I'm saying? So she was saying shit like, you know, she used to do the same thing and, and listen to music, the sad music and, and, um, you know, stuff like that to get her in that dark place. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, sometimes we find ourselves wanting to be in a dark place and I don't know why, you know? There's some things that I should have faced a long time ago that was right in my face that I should have grasped a long time ago that I didn't. And I just let shit build up and build up and build up. I just, I just can't take the shit no more. False realities are putting shit at the back <clears throat> and continuing to to save face, no matter what the circumstance is. 
<clears throat> but they did that to me. All right, cool. They did that to me. Cool. All last year, all I ever said was, or well, this year, all I ever said was, it's all good. It's all good. I still say it to today. Man, this shit ain't good. And to be honest, I wouldn't be able to be so transparent with y'all if, you know, I wasn't, you know, speaking with her. Like, when we all go through things like this, we have to speak to someone. So, guys, please don't act as if, you know, I'm just leaning on her. She is just the person that has just, you know, um, I don't know. Like, she's making me do something. She's not making me do anything. She's just uh, picking my brain, for sure. As a friend, she is picking my brain. Um, and I, I appreciate it. And that's normally what I do to other people. <clears throat> I pick their brain. I help people get up when they down. You know what I'm saying? I help people feel better. I find out solutions for other people. And for some reason, can't find one for me. But it's always in my face. It's always in my face, bro. Like, <laughs> I cannot tell y'all, like, and where I was going was, um, you know, <clears throat> before speaking with her, I wouldn't have been able to talk to y'all. So if y'all haven't noticed, for like the past several months, maybe six, eight months, you know what I'm saying? I've been saying, I can't say anything. I can't speak. I can't talk. I can't, I cannot express myself. I had, I could not like for real. It's almost like it would not come out. Like, you know what I'm saying? And when I met her, I was doing the same shit to her. Like, I don't want to talk about it. This ain't nothing to talk about. We don't need to talk. You don't talk about everything. You know what I'm saying? And I wasn't that person, you know, a year ago. A year ago, I was overly communicative. You know what I'm saying? To the point where somebody wanted to kill me. Like, goddamn, shut up. You know what I'm saying? Like, and I'll keep talking about it, keep talking about it. And then it got to the point where, you know, the tables turned. I couldn't talk. Couldn't say shit. Nothing. And she was like, yo, this is not how you... This is not how you get through things. Like, how in the hell are you going to get through anything and you can't talk? I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> like, and to be honest, she has worked on this with me for months. And, and and you know, like, like once again, we're going to do a video because I want y'all to introduce y'all to really who she is. Because where I did mess up at is not introducing her. And I know y'all like, bro, who is this? You know what I'm saying? I get it. I'm not mad at y'all. That's why I don't have anything bad to say about y'all's comments. Because this is my fault. You know, this is definitely my fault. Um, and a lot of people are being overprotective of me, you know, because of what I am going through. So I get where y'all coming from. I'm not, I don't have nothing bad to say about what y'all saying. Some of y'all dragging it, but you know, what would be, what would YouTube be without a drag? What would YouTube be without a drag? So, um, but I just was not able to communicate nothing. And for the past three or four months, she has been like, bro, talk. We'll have whole life fall out because I won't talk. You know what I'm saying? Literally, won't say nothing. I'm doing the same thing to Slim right now. And it's just like, nigga, talk. And and I'm 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 working on it. You know what I'm saying? For sure. And that's why I'm able to make this video now. Even when I was making videos to y'all and I was saying that I'm trying to just speak, I'm gonna just speak. This shit wasn't making no sense, you know? And a lot of people like, you know, I just watched this video for nothing. You didn't say anything, you know? And now I get it. I wasn't saying nothing, you know? So I understand why people can have some frustration with me um, and all that. I get it, you know? But... <clears throat> I'm ready for us to do this video so I can't introduce her properly. And so she can talk herself and, and let y'all know what's going on. You know what I'm saying? But man, I just, I woke up on a better note. So what I did this morning, because you know, your day is based off how you wake up. Period. I've been waking up earlier for sure. You know what I'm saying? Literally. Uh, And that feels better. Like before 10 o'clock, before 9 o'clock type shit. And... um. This morning, I decided to meditate. So yesterday, I attempted to meditate twice. As soon as I got into the outer body feeling, because with meditation, you can have an outer body feeling, like some shit that just is different, you know? And 
I didn't fear that outer body feeling. It <laughs> it made me like hold up, like it made me snap a little bit, but I I I enjoyed what it gave me, you know? <clears throat> as soon as I got into it, you know what I'm saying? Um I started hearing loud noises. Um in the house because it's other people in the house so it kind of threw me off and i decided to just attempt to do it this morning and i did it this morning and the first one i did he was talking about chakras throughout you know your alignment and honestly i i, I liked it but i didn't like it as much as i liked the one yesterday so i tried another one after that and i did about 15 minutes of it and at the end of it he told me to love myself you know what i'm saying hold myself and imagine me just loving me, you know what I'm saying? And that has definitely put me in a better place today. <clears throat> because yesterday, I put in a clip, you know what I'm saying? I, I bought Duce at 1 o'clock. Y'all, yesterday I went to buy some Duce and um, because I know I'm all over the place. I want to talk about the signs before I get off this video. The signs I had was, A, my mama texted me like, hey, how you doing? You know. I'm like, woo! You have no idea. But uh, I'm going to tell my mama I'm alright. I'm going to tell my mama I'm fine. And I'm not. Um, Then I get to the liquor store. It's closed. I forgot yesterday was Sunday. And I'm like, why well, is the liquor store closed? It's 1 o'clock. Um, still did not come to my mind. <clears throat> I'm, I just got through crying. I was upset. So then I get to the, you know, I'm I go back to the car. He ready for us to come in. <clears throat> I'm walking in with a guy that's about 45, 50 years old. And he was waiting like me. And it just put me in a mindset of... <clears throat> I'm I'm sitting here 30. You know, going to the liquor store. Trying to drink my pain away. And what I kept saying is I didn't want to feel the pain. But I, I'm trying to drink my pain away. And this guy that's 45, maybe 50 years old. Not trying to judge a book by his cover. But maybe he's there. Because he started drinking or, or was been drinking at my age. And now this is how he copes at 45, 50 years old. Once again, I am not judging this man. I could be very wrong. But that is just what I got from it in that moment. You know? <clears throat> and it's, it was not a good feeling. And it's just like, you know, I'm better than that. I am better than that. I'm better than this. You know what I'm saying? And I'm so happy that I actually can come on this video and just say that. I'm so happy I could do that. Thank you, Jalen. Jalen, Jalen, Jalen. I'm, I'm, uh, we're gonna do a video. Um, cause I want, I want y'all to, you know, meet her. But, you know, some people come in your life as your guardian angel. You know what I'm saying? As your your angel for real. We have angels in real human form. I've been other people's angel. For some of y'all, I am y'all's angel. And, and, and that's crazy because as y'all's angel, your angel ain't feeling too good. You know what I'm saying? Your angel is not in the in the best mind place. The best, the best mind state. But I'm going to continue to do the best I can to make sure I can help other people because that is what I'm here to do you know even when I have to have somebody else help me we all need help you know um but she's she's my angel and not in a sexual way not in a a, a girlfriend way not in a relationship way like she my motherfucking nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, for real. Good friend. But yeah, y'all. I'm done with this video. I'm about to go to the gym. Uh, shout out to Nutriburst. So, quick ad. I want y'all to know that Nutriburst is a multivitamin that uh, gives you wings, nigga. You know what I'm saying? When I want to work out, I, I go in the gym, I get it in. You dig? I get it in. Okay? Um, And I've been drinking this for quite some time now. And yesterday, I did not drink this. And, and that time of me going through that, I didn't even want to drink it. I'm like, I don't even want that liquor to mess this up. Instead, I was supposed to drink this instead of the liquor. But anyway. I poured the liquor out. Thank you. I don't know where to go. Thank you for that. What are you doing? Why don't you open the door? Open the door. That's 
all my dead homies. This ain't even for them. They don't need this shit neither. Oh, God, that hurt. Oh. Oh. And I'm in a better place. Also, I so CBD tea. This tea uh, helps you lose weight and it detoxifies your intestines, your kidneys, your stomach in general, and just all this bad shit in your body. You know what I'm saying? And I haven't been taking it consistently because I've been wanting to be in this dark place, man. But I got to get out of it. Today is the day, okay? Um, and I'm not perfect. I ain't no telling if I'm going to have another bad day, y'all. Every dog had a day. But today, I'm going to enjoy today. Y'all enjoy today, too. And if you're going through this shit, man, you're not alone. Even your angel can have a bad day. Even your angel might not be able to have their wings today. You might be able to... You might have to have my wings for me today. You know what I'm saying? For real. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all, man. I'll see y'all uh, in the next video. Peace out. I want to make a, um, a sit-down video. But I'm just going to start it off like this. the first person that I've met that actually just cares. You watching porn, huh? Get! <laughs> why are you on my shit? I hate that! You are so nosy! Bro, I was just trying to go to the... You nosy as fuck! Oh, okay. What do you see then? What is that? What is <laughs> what? I need the GPS. I don't know what that is. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. You just give me a. Let it slide.